Hey everybody, welcome back to V-Games Gone Wild. Let's go into day two of our game. We are playing Zero Escape. And I'm just going to go ahead and jump right into it, because this game is fucking awesome. And I want to keep going with it. Alright, so... Where are we at? Alright, let's see. At and we're on D-Team, and I said next we're going to check out and see what this gun was. So let's go ahead and do that now. Hi, Maple! Alright, here we go. Let's see what this gun's all about. Okay, it looks like we're going to get a three-way decision. And then based on that three-way decision, we can have two different endings, or then another one that'll get us into two more decisions. Okay, so uh, when it comes time to make the decision, let me know what, what you guys want, and that's the decision I'm going to go with. So here we go. Ready? Let's go. Let me know how the volume and the picture and everything looks. Hope you guys can hear me. Fire. 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 <laughs> fire. Fire. Step into my office. You're fucking fired! This room is... The trash, the trash disposal. disposal. Isn't that Isn't what that it's what called on the map? The map? 18 minutes to go until your mind gets erased again. Where's mine? I don't know. You don't, you don't know? know? When I woke I up, she was already, she was already gone. gone. Maybe, Maybe she managed to get out of this room. room. Do you so think we can? can? So we're stuck in another room. It opened. Sigma, Sigma it, opened. it opened. And? and? Uh, um, well, well, I didn't, I didn't really, really expect, expect it to, so... Well, you want it out, so fucking leave, stupid. Oh, what five stuck in the incinerator! Cutting my next album. What do you think I'm doing? I'm locked in here. That's the incinerator! She's gonna burn up! Why? How should I know? This is where I was when I woke up. Stuck inside this incinerator. Oh, that fucking sucks. You're gonna burn up, bitch. Hang <laughs> Hang on. I'll get you out now. You chose the wrong place to take a nap. Is there a keyhole? I don't see, I don't see one. one. Probably, Probably an electronic, an electronic lock. lock. I've got a bad feeling about this. I've got a good feeling about this. You're gonna burn. <laughs> Incinerator start. Will not commence. Incineration in 30 minutes. Oh, well, you might want to hit the e-stop. It's gonna be okay, okay fine. Stay, Stay calm. calm. You're the one flailing and freaking out here. Anyway, we have to do something. Either stop the incinerator startup, or unlock the door. Okay. Huh. I'll see if I can do anything on this side. I'm you know, in real life, those things are really hard to start and keep going. So I really don't think she'd have to worry. I'd like to avoid the worst sunburn of my life in here. Let's hurry. Right. right. If you've ever worked maintenance at all, you know stuff like that is very hard to keep working, so... Okay, we gotta try and find a way out. Seek a way out. What I like about this game is, remember our timeline? We woke up, and, uh... Let's see if I can show you guys. Oh, yeah, there's my memo. There's a memo. Okay. Remember, keep that in mind, penis. This is how we get out of this room. <laughs> Wait, we gotta make a page two. We gotta make a page two. We're we'll going... <laughs> Boobs. There we go. <laughs> That's our memo. So we can anytime we need to reference how to get out of a room, we can go check out the memo, and uh, we'll know how to get out of the room. <laughs> Oops, wrong button. I already know what the memo is. Okay. So I want to go to my chart. Okay, where's my chart at? Anyways, see what it is, is we keep waking up and having no memory of what happened beforehand. So the last one I was locked in a different room, it obviously happened after this, because some fucking chick with a knife murdered all my people. And then one girl got out, but as she was leaving the door, the chick with the knife murdered her too. So that had to have happened after this. So after this happens, they get locked in another room, and that's when all that happens. So this, this timeline thing is fucking weird. So... Let's figure out how we get out of here. Oh, 
Okay. Whoa. Virtual reality masks? This is a mask with goggles. Okay. Let's examine them. Looks like a gas mask, but why would something like this be in here? Why not try it on? You might look good. Do you think complimenting everything a woman wears is okay? You're wrong, sir. Oh, I'm wearing it. Look, I'm wearing the gas mask. And I can see stuff that wasn't there before. Tick. Let me go. I want to finish this locker before I do anything here. It's a toolbox. So it's inside the toolbox. It's a toolbox. We can't open it because it's screwed shut. And the tool is open. To open it is inside the toolbox. Damn you, zero. Okay. I want to keep this. I want to keep the mask on because it's letting me see stuff at the moment. Okay. Back. Yeah, it's same one from last night. So I'm continuing. I'm continuing the game. I had a lot of fun with it. I want to see where it's going with it. Okay, there's a button in there. Looks like it. There are four screws holding it over the plate. Okay, so that's probably the e-stop. Remember I said e-stop before you push the button and it stops? Or it's what turns it on. I don't know yet. Okay, tick. Well, there are letters floating above the poster. Tick. Huh? Where? Right here. Tick in plastic. It's circled and in big letters. Ah, you must be able to see them because of the goggles you have on. You call this augmented reality, but why do these letters appear? Maybe it's some sort of hint. Okay. So, tick. Is there a clock in here? There's something hanging on the wall? Let's see what this is. It's a gas torch. Maybe it's a gas torch. Burn open the toolbox? No. Alright, let's see. Let's have the gas torch on in case it wants me to do something with the gas torch. Bunch of buttons I don't want to fuck with because I don't want to accidentally start the machine as very soon as possible. Okay, there's nothing else we can use in here. Let's check out the door. Looks like a dust chute. I think it's connected to the inside of the incinerator, incinerator possibly, but it looks like it's locked. We can put in some input some numbers. Okay, it's something grams, so it's G. Let's go back to the poster and see if there's anything else in the poster. Let's see, it's a tick G. No. Nothing else. Huh, if you guys see anything, let me know, because these puzzles are pretty cool so far. Huh, the floor here isn't level. It could open up. Maybe it's a trap. Better not stand on it if we can help it. Stop. It says stop here, so maybe we'll stop the incineration process. If it does, then it's one less thing to worry about. Let's find a key that fits this. We better have to feel calmer once the fire is safe. Wait a second. Isn't the keyhole too big? Hey, isn't it too big for my slot? That's what she said. The door's locked, there's no, key no keyhole problem electronic lock. This door connects to the incinerator, maybe we can open it and I can get out. Nope, didn't mean to do that. Stop! It's annoying. I'm alright, just sent from trash and gagging me. Thank God, we need to get you out quick if you find anything useful. Nothing yet, it's too dark to look around. Can you see if you can make it brighter in here? Okay, got it, we'll see what we can do. All she's concerned about is fucking being able to see. Sigma over here, I can see some images in the air. What are they? A screwdriver and two screws. Maybe some sort of clue. Let's take note of it. I think we can put some numbers in here. Why don't we give it a try? I don't want to. I don't want to put numbers in there because it might make... Oh, check my memo. Okay, my memo was a lot of help. I what I need right now. I don't want to, because if I put the wrong numbers in and it starts stuff, that's not right. Yeah, let's see if we can do anything to make this brighter. Control console, but there's nothing happening when we touch it. Alright, check this out. There's a bunch of meters here. There's a thermometer, but measure the temperatures inside the incinerator. 
the coin at the base of the needle? Why would it be here? Why is there a coin there? Dude, there's so much shit going on in this room right now. Seriously, there's a lot of shit going on. Hey, Sensei. This is uh, No Escape. It's a brand new game. And uh, nine people are trapped inside this place. And six of them have to die to get the, uh, the passwords to get out. But uh, that's not what's happening because they're murdering us for, for no reason sometimes. And more than six can die. Okay, so there's a gun with a lock and key. Okay, there's a padlock. What should we do? Okay, uh, Okay. so I, all I did is I found a whole bunch of shit that I don't know what to do with. So this tick has something to do with everything. Maybe if I can uh, burn it. Maybe I can burn it. Some letters are floating in a post when we got those. I look at it. Okay, that doesn't help me any. stuck at the moment. Okay, I can't use the... I'm trying to use the torch on chip, but it's not letting me. So far, nothing's doing really shit. The store isn't locked, we can go into the hall whenever we want, but no way we're abandoning the Phi. We should stop the process before we open the door. I want to step on this plate. Maybe I can put the toolbox on the plate. No, that's not working. What the fuck do I do? It's not any. It's not letting me do nothing. Hey, hey, Sensi, welcome to the party! Woo, woo, woo! You got yourself a Tails! Oh, sliders, and they got numbers on them, so it's gonna be TIC like on the sign. Ha! Hey, one more. Okay, we did something right, so something's gonna happen now. Okay, this should be the right answer. Oh, the shutter's open. Awesome. I wonder if the bitch is gonna burn. I did it! Now that I can see here, I'll try and look for something useful. Hey, Fire, are you okay? She looks nervous. In a place like that, I have to get her out. We have to find a way to get her out or stop the incinerator process. I can't really hear you guys, but could you get your butts moving and do something? <laughs> Okay, alright, I'm looking around the slide. Can you hear me? How's it going in there? We're searching everywhere. See, I can't just take that coin out. So we found out what to do with the tick, and we got the sliders open, but now nothing's happening. I would think that would be up to Phi to figure something out now. All my stuff is gone. Where'd all my stuff go? out. Whoa, whoa, there's my penis. I think the game's messing up. Okay, there it goes. Whoa, what is this? I didn't see that before. Oh, we're fine. Now we're fine. Okay, that's what's happening. We're the chick now. We're on the inside. That's what it looks like before we get our asses burnt up. <laughs> okay, there's a scale. Oh, a screwdriver. Okay, we got a flathead screwdriver. I know, she could at least get naked now. I mean, it's like, come on, let's just do a little dance. Do a little dance. Make a little love. 
You're going to burn. The bitch is going to burn. Okay, this is I don't see what opens. Ash is hoping this will not be me. Yeah, that's probably going to be you. It really stinks. I get out and remove the iron bars, but they're both not tight. Trash here and the stench is horrible. There's a hole for the dust chute. It's impossible, so it's impossible to send things from this side. Damn, why am I in here? It's better than I'm not the only one who gets locked in. I'm counting on you guys. Even if I broke the glass, I doubt I'd be able to get through. Actually, that's probably the best thing to do, because if you break the glass, then the incinerator lights up. You can lay on the floor while the heat rushes out the windows and maybe survive. Okay, so all I gotta do is click on that, and I go back to person to person. So I gotta figure out a way to give them the screwdriver. Alright. It's a weigh station. I'll try weighing the screwdriver. One, three, three. Okay, I know what that means. I know what that means. Watch this. Okay, switch back to them. Click on this. And put the numbers in here. Bet me. Ah, oh, no! Failed! It was it. must have to do with the screwdriver and the screws I saw. That means we don't have enough information. We can't get lucky every time. You're right, let's search around for more clues to open this. Damn. It was worth a try. I thought that was it. Let's go back to her. I'm not a cutie! Shut up! Yeah, I'm entertaining! Woohoo! <laughs> I try to be entertaining, but I'm just being normal. Why don't she just step on it? What is this? It's a thermometer, but why is there one in here? To check the temperature of the trash? I should keep in mind what temperature is going to be when the incineration starts. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. The wall is screwed on. I doubt it's connected to the outside, though. Might as well take it off. That's a good idea. Oh! 188 pounds! It was right there all the time! I'll hold on to the screws just in case. Alright, nope. We're not going to do 188 pounds. 85 kilograms. What is this weight? Or maybe. Sigma, how much do you weigh? How much do you all of a sudden, how much do you weigh? Call HR is a sexual harassment, old man. It's just 188 pounds. Yeah, more or less. How do you know? It's a coincidence it says that. It can't be. It must be part of Zero's plan. Hold on. No, 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 no. Hold on. I'm going to get back to that. I got to get on this. And put the screws there. Alright. Screwdriver weighs 133. Alright, and the screws weigh 22. So that's 155. Right? 155. We'll get back to the 188 in a minute. Come on, baby! Come on! We got it! Show me the money! 155! The screws can't possibly weigh that much, though, but that's okay. We're not going for reality here. We're going to stop if we get the bitch from getting burned. Yeah! Whoa! Not 188. 155. Okay, we can send things to the other side. Let's get this toolbox spot. Yeah, she should be able to open it since she has a screwdriver. Why don't the girl send the screwdriver through the chutes? I got it! Hold on a second. You don't get it yet. We're not done. Don't switch me over when I don't tell you to switch me. I wasn't done yet. I'm gonna put more shit in the shoot. Shit in the shoot. I'm gonna put more shit in the shoot. I'm gonna shoot the shit. I'm putting the gas torch in the dust chute. Please take it. Here you go. No, damn it! Quit switching! I didn't want to switch back and forth. I want to freaking beat these people. I'm gonna put more stuff in the shoot. I wonder who had balls in there. See if she grabs them. No, let go! It's not bubble gum! <laughs> 
Do the mask. Can I? Nope, it's too big. That's what she said. Alright, so now let's go back to her. Alright, so now we're gonna take. Where the. Oh, she got the torch ready. Toolbox, better be some tools inside that I can use. It's not opening, it's screwed shut. Oh, no shit, stupid, use your screwdriver. Alright, what do we get out of here? Please be porn. Please be porn. Please be porn. Some kind of puzzle. Doesn't look like there are tools. Doesn't look like the tools are set correctly. It's just like a puzzle. Oh my. What the fuck am I supposed to do? Okay, I think I'm supposed to set the tools in here so that way they don't touch any of the X's. Alright, so. Oh no, they have to touch X. No, they can't. Because that don't touch an X no matter what I do. supposed to do here? I, I'm, I don't have any idea. I'm probably just being stupid right now. I, I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one, two, three, four. Ah, see, they all match, though. Hmm. But I can't spin them, can I? Aha! I can. Which means I got an idea. No. I need to get one in the bottom right hand corner, but I don't I don't have one that does that. So that's not right. That's not right. That's not right. That's the only thing that seems to work. Oh that works. We can move this somewhere else. And we can put Okay, I got it. I'm learning. Nope. Fuck, that's wrong. It's four squares, not two. Okay. 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 Yeah. Groovy. Okay. Oh shit, look at this! Look at this, boy! Look at this! Who's your fucking daddy? Yeah, look at that! Boom! Completed! Hey, good job, uh, 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 uh Maple. This is the bottom right. Good, the wrong place now. The bottom good apartment's open. Oh, I get a note. Max out the needle. Okay. Max out the needle. Okay, Diana, there's a needle over here. A needle, I don't think so, but there's a needle over on the meter. Which meter? I think it's for a thermometer. I see. So I want to put shit on there, right? Wait. I got an idea. I think I need to burn trash. No? Hmm. Why can't I give them the sc I should be able to give them the screwdriver, seriously. Can't I pass that through the chute? It's a hole for the dust chute. Fine. Can you hear me? Yeah, what is it? Crawl through this hole. You got this. You old bastard, it's impossible. I just get stuck because of my big chest. You are not a double D! You are such a liar! You are not a double D! I have stared at her chest for like five minutes, and I could not see big enough boob out print to be a double D. Do you know what big is? God, Diana, could you take off your clothes? <laughs>
<laughs> Wait, what are you two talking about? We need to be serious about this. <laughs> That's great. That's great. Good stuff. Good banter. Awesome banter. I like the I like the witty banterness. Okay, 188. Years. Okay, it's just about how much Sigma weighs. So we gotta get Sigma to do something. Let's go back to these guys. I really think she could crawl through. I really think she could. I think she's just being a freaking lazy bitch and not trying. Let's take these off. Okay. Now there was this thing over here where you could step on, and I think Sigma needs to step on it. There's a section of the floor that isn't level. What does it mean? And it won't let me walk on it. So it almost looks like I could push this, but it doesn't give me the option to. Nothing else won't let me look at the ceiling. Can't do anything with any of that. I guess I gotta go back to five. Five's gotta figure out the next part of this. Alright, so we got a screwdriver. 188 pounds. Okay. We got screws, screws. Back. Alright, so there's something I'm missing. There's something I'm missing, there's something I'm not seeing. Do you guys see anything? you guys notice anything I didn't notice? No, it's gotta be with these guys. figure this shit out. I will get it. You know what, and, and two, there's, there's a thing, like, you see that pipe? Well, that's electric pipe, but there should be another pipe around here. And that would be the, uh, the gas pipe. And now she says the letters to open up the shutter. She didn't say that before. They won't let me leave. You know, they should, they should hand the screwdriver through the chute, and they put the screwdriver through these holes and punch the screwdriver to push the button. That's what fucking somebody would really do. The, the chick has the screwdriver, and she won't give it to me. Fi has it, see? I, won't, I don't know why she don't put it through the chute. I don't think it'll... Oh, I'll fit. I don't want you to fit. I want you to put the fucking screwdriver through the hole. <laughs> Excuse me. Now, they gave me the torch, so... It seems like she should be able to do something with the torch in here. missing something. It's all it is. I'm missing something. Spot where the flames come out. I wonder how powerful it is. Maybe there's something I can hide behind if the incinerator starts up. Yeah, I don't think so. I know. Maybe if I stuff trash into the furnace. Damn it, it stinks to high heaven. I need to stop firing myself up or else I'll really be... Stay calm, Fi. Can I do that? No, it won't let me. It won't let me stuff trash in there, which is actually a really good idea. <laughs> Let's see how much his gas torch weighs. 360. Okay. I'm just trying anything right now, guys. Yeah, I tried to burn the trash, but it didn't do anything. Oh, 
Oh, I'm heating the, the thermometer with the gas torch. Okay. Well, I'm not, I'm not baking yet. Did something happen? The needle and thermometer here is shooting up. Is it getting really hot in there? Okay, it's not getting hot in here. We're putting the torch on the thermometer so it thinks it's getting hot in there when it's really not. Yeah, good call, Sensi. Burn the, burn the thermometer. Good call. No, I'm fine. I see. So it is connected to the thermometer outside. So glad. The coin here is... Yeah, the coin came off, right? The coin came off. Okay, so now I have a coin. And I'm going to use the coin on this box over here because they said it was too big to be a screwdriver slot. Remember that? So yeah, I retain information. The keyhole would stop button, but it doesn't look too big for a key. So we'll put the coin in. And it's not letting me. Looks like a regular coin. So why does it why doesn't it do it? Why doesn't it let me put the coin in there? Am I like doing stuff that's like, oh, this would work in real life, but it's not gonna work in the game? Probably what it is. We can use the coin to unscrew it. There we go. Yes, they're off. Seems like we didn't need a screwdriver after all. We removed the cover, but you should really but should we really up and press this button so carelessly? I'd like a tiny guillotine to come out when you push it and chop off your hand? What? You're gonna forget you said that very much. I'm pushing it. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What the fuck is that? Oh good, my hand's still intact. Something came out of the floor. What is it? It looks like a chair. A, a chair from here. What the fuck? It's some kind of fucking torture chair. Look at that shit. It's got a collar, and it's got things that wrap your wrist in. I bet if somebody sits in there, they're fucked. How about we don't fucking sit in the chair? Thank you. How about we just use the coin and get out? That's what I gotta do. I know that's what I have to do. Hold on. First off, let's back out of here. Let's see if we can pass the coin through the shoe. I really don't want to go in the chair if I can help it. I really think that's just a bad idea. I just think it's a really, really not good idea to sit in that chair. Oh, the coin's gone. I used the coin to open up the screws and it just disappears. So now my only choice I have left, the only thing I can do now is sit in the chair. I don't want to, but I have no other choice. So let's sit in the chair. Oh, it's a chair, is it? We should try sitting on it. You're a fucking dumbass is what you are. Hey, hey, don't be so hasty. Nothing's happening. Because you gotta weigh 188 pounds. You gotta weigh what Sigma weighs. I see, it's harmless. Why is it here then? Do you want to try it out too? It's a little hard though. That's what she said. Uh, maybe we can figure something out by sitting on it. Yeah, you're stupid. HA! I told you, you fucking idiot! I knew that was gonna happen! What the hell? I can't move. You know what they should have done? They should have fucking just put weight on it, like stood on it or something, so that way none of the clams can get his neck or hands, and he's just standing on it. Because that way he's still 180 pounds and still be on the seat, and all that would still activate. Incineration in three minutes. Sigma, Diana, what the hell's going on? I think we tripped something. I'm restrained, but Diana's fine. What do you say? What did you say? I said I'm a fucking dumbass and I fucking sat on the obvious trap. I mean, no. Why did it? It was fine when I sat on it, so why? Take a deep breath, Diana. We can get past this if we just deal with it calmly. Uh, okay, hold on. I'll find a way to get you two out. Counting on you. Five first. She doesn't have much time left. Oh shit, the gun's out. Don't forget to look behind you. The box that hung from the ceiling dropped, because I know you're stupid and couldn't hear that loud fucking clanking on the floor. Hey, how's it going, stupid? <laughs> He's like, I have assumed the position. Present balls. <laughs> hey. Actually, I have an idea. I have a good idea. Let's let's go ahead and erase this. We're done, we're done, we're done. We don't need to look at the penis no more. That's enough notes. We got enough notes off of this, okay? There we go. Let's get rid of that. Alright, no more, no more jizz. There we go. Alright, now... <laughs> yeah, look at him! in the 
chair. Take it, take it, take it. <laughs> He's like, oh, oh, it's making, it's making my nipples hard. <laughs> Sigma, what's happening? No, nothing's happening, but something's going to happen. I really like this. <laughs> Sigma, I never knew. <laughs> Alright, we're just fucking with him before he dies. <laughs> Alright, where'd the box go? <laughs> Alright, <laughs> this was hanging from the ceiling. I should maybe use the gun if I can get it out. <laughs> Alright, so how do we open this? <laughs> yeah, he definitely does seem the type. Okay. Chain box is hanging from the ceiling. I need to get the lock open. The keyhole is hexagonal. Oh, the time is... Okay, so... How do I get a hexagonal device? It's an Allen wrench. Where do I get an Allen wrench from? Five, you found something over there? No, I think that's everything on this side. Damn it, there's no time to waste. Alright, so there's nothing else to do in here is what she's saying. I have to take her word on that. But then we'll... Oh, okay, the scale is for everything else. <clears throat> And so we need a hexagonal device. I don't see anything else in here, really. Just gotta follow the clues. <laughs> oh wow, your chest is strong. Satisfied? Why the fuck is she looking? <laughs> now Sigma's trapped too, what should I do? Stop focusing me on, Diana. I'm only being restrained. Bye, she doesn't have much time. You're right, I need to stop that. Penis. Uh, I just thought maybe an important clue could be hitting someone. <laughs> I check his crotch, and she says, I thought maybe an important clue would be hitting somewhere. Well, there is something important there. <laughs> yes. Yes. Oh, God, I'm sorry. It's not like that. I didn't mean it's not like that. He's like, indeed, it is like that. Yes, it is. Now you know the truth. <laughs> What are you doing with my face? Go search somewhere else. He's getting pissed. He's like, stop fucking with me, bitch. <clears throat> if only I had the key that goes with it, maybe I could stop the incineration. I don't think that's a keyhole. I really don't. A thermometer isn't going to help me. I need to hurry and do something. Check the other side. Please open up. What should I do? Huh. So how do I get this box open? There's nothing to open the box with. Look at him with the goggles on. Maybe that'll show me something. No. You lost your mind while you're staring at me through those goggles. I don't even know what I'm doing right now. See something on the keypad? No. No. Okay, I'm stuck again. Hmm. Stuck again. The thing fell from the ceiling. And it won't even let me open it. <clears throat> Need a hexagonal key. 
Let's see, what am I missing? I'm missing something. Nope, what is that? I'm missing something here. It's gotta be something little, or else I probably would have seen it by now. Anything else? The goggles on the wall? Tick. I already got all those clues. Nothing with the racks in the bottom. Oh, I don't know what to do now. What the fuck? I think I might be stumped at the moment. There must be a way I have to. Please know I can't give up. Well, let me look at that, whatever that is. There's nothing hexagonal. There's nothing I could use to open this box. Can I put the box through the chute? <laughs> if I hold on to the chain and drop this down, I'll be able to pull it back up. If I am dropping the box down, could you open the lock for us? Aha! Aha! Alright, I'm on it. That's what she said. But now, how am I going to open it? Let me just examine it first. A padlock. I can't open it without a key. Oh. Key shaped like a hex gun. Hmm. If I use the grip like this... Yes, it's open. I use the back of the screwdriver. I open the lock, pull the chain up. Got it. And if I pull the chain up, I can get the gun. Alright, now I got a revolver. Revolver, what should I do? A muzzle, maybe it'll fit. A muzzle, maybe, maybe it'll fit in what? Your vagina? There was no fucking where. Put the gun in his mouth. Hey, open up! Open your mouth! Let me see the gun you got from the box. Huh, this is, you know what? The muzzle might fit in the keyhole right next to me. Okay. I think the gun will go in here. Please fit. Oh! Oh, shit, it's pointing at his face! Look, I know where it's pointing! Uh-uh! Oh, son! Okay, I found the key. The gun was the key. Okay, awesome. Zero. But first, I will tell you a story about the past. We kicked ass just now, guys. We kicked ass. As a result, after a falsely accused man was sentenced to death, his wife took her own life. A taxi driver died in an accident along with his passenger, a surgeon. The child, who awaited a critical operation, also perished. Okay. Six people all together. Why did these six die? Because of a snail. A single solitary snail. It's probably not chain reactions and cause and effect bullshit, but I don't believe it. Now then, to explain the rules, it should be clear that a revolver is set up beside the chair right now. It contains six rounds. Three are alive, and three are black. Though they are randomized with the Oh, nice. Chair. Russian roulette. And the odds of life will fire from the gun are six to three. Why don't you just empty the fucking chamber? So basically, if she would have shot the gun instead of putting it in the keyhole, the door would have broken. Ooh! 
Ooh, good one! So if I pull the gun, there's a 50-50 chance it's gonna blow his fucking face off. But it'll free her. There's no time, Diana. Or I can do nothing, and she'll burn up for sure. Which one, Which one has more to gain? More to gain? If, we if we don't, don't pull that pull trigger, that trigger I'd obviously, obviously stay, alive. stay alive. My chance of survival would clearly be 100%. 100%. But then it but then guarantee Fi's death, death, as her survival rate would be zero. zero. What, happens what happens if we do pull it then? The incinerator door would open, and Fi escapes. Chance of survival, 100%. And this choice still allows for the possibility that I may live. A blank round. My head doesn't suddenly have a new hole. It's 50-50. So you understand. So understand. That's what I would, I would pull the trigger. It's either 100 say? and 0 or 100 and 50. It's obvious, it's obvious which one is the wiser choice. choice. How dare you not even consider everyone else's feelings, Sigma? <laughs> what, what if the, if the shot, shot is a live bullet? bullet? Then he dies. Do you Stupid. really want Diana to end up blowing your head off with her own hands? But, but fine. fine. If I don't if I pull, pull the trigger, trigger you'll... Huh? You'll die, Don't bitch. worry about me. No! Diana, Diana please, please, listen, listen to, me. to me. What would what be would the be most ideal, ideal outcome, outcome from this? From this? Isn't, Isn't it obvious? Not putting the gun in the keyhole and that shooting both the of you stay alive. Okay, okay. then think. think. Which, Which one, one of those choices, choices has that result as a possibility? possibility. If you don't pull it at all, you guys have already made the choice that you want. Okay, die. I want to pull the trigger if, if that's really what you guys want. want to save both of us. I got two pulls oh, and no one anything else. Pull the trigger, Diana! No! You shut, you shut up. up! Yeah, you shut up, bitch. Men are talking here. All right, anybody else? Don't Last choice. Just pull or don't pull. Us. No, don't do it. He is dead. He is so dead. Okay, time to decide. I got oh shit, I gotta pull or don't pull. I pulled the trigger. You guys said pull, I did what you said. Rush your roulette. What happens? You die or not? Was it a blank or not? So you guys know the game's random. Sometimes there's a bullet in there, and sometimes there's not. It's completely random. Okay, so we saved five for sure. Incinerator door is open. Incineration process terminated. No. no. It can't, it can't be. be. Oh, was it? Come on. Oh, there was a bullet in the chamber! Oh, his face is gone! Oh, you die with a penis in your mouth. Oh. Why? Why, Why did Why you did do, you do it? it? You Why murderer. Did you do it? Murderer! Shut up, bitch. I wasn't. I didn't matter at all. I didn't. I didn't. didn't. So why? Uh, why is she going down on her? Why did you? Why are you going down on her? Your boyfriend's dead, so you want a new chick already? Look, at she's dripping. She wants it. <laughs> Well, at least now you still have the gun. And there's there's only five more people that need to die to get the code. <laughs> oh my god, she's gonna kill herself! Sigma. I'll be joining you. Soon. Wait! Diana! Stop! Oh my god, she blew her brains out! This game is disgusting! She did it! Diana! Diana! What are the odds that the, the first two bullets are both, you know... I bet you they were lying. I bet you it wasn't 50-50. Fucking Zero lied and had six rounds in there instead of three. Game over. Alright. So we'll save it. And let's check our storyline now. Gotta check our flowchart. Alright, so we did this one and we did this one. And we're still, look, these these were ones where they were sleeping and woke up in different rooms. Alright, so let's see. 
pretty good. Alright, so it looks like in this one there's no Psy. These ones are all three alive. So these are times where they woke up before the gunshot one. Let's see, so let's go with this one. Alright, and it looks like this one only has one choice and it leads down other roads. So let's check this one out. Stuff. Damn, I wish more people would come watch me play. This stuff is so fun. Um, where's Vi? I don't, I don't see, see her. her. She could have woken first, first and wandered, wandered off. off. Sigma. Sigma! Sigma! Oh, four minutes. Huh? Huh? It's after midnight now. What? what? Tell, Tell me, me the year, year turned, turned over. over. No, Misty, this, this, this happened the before the gun was. 2028. Huh. 2029. How, How long have we been asleep, asleep then? My last memory was ten and a half hours ago. You're talking, You're talking about, about the vote at 1330? 1330? Yes. But that doesn't Does mean, mean we've only, only been sleeping, sleeping though. though. We could have woken up several times. Right, they keep erasing the You're saying the amnesia drug made us forget. Well, better start looking for Phi. <laughs> Watch out for some yes, fucking chicken right. right with a knife. So we know that happens later. Oh, the puppy. Hi, puppy. Puppy's back. Puppy. <clears throat> Okay, they're showing us various rooms. Well, that had a, a weird lock on one of the lockers. You guys probably don't want to go in the incinerator. Maybe that's where uh, Five's at right now, then this is before they found her in the incinerator. This is the last, last of the rooms. rooms. That Five, where'd, where'd she, she go? go? Yeah, that's probably what this is. She's in the incinerator sleeping. Zero. She's in the incinerator. Damn it! So what are your orders? First, I shall explain the rule to you. As the name suggests, this room contains a device called a transporter. Okay. It was discovered roughly 140 years ago, in the year 1888, I don't think so. at the South Pole. A German expedition was exploring the area. At one point, they became lost, and subsequently stumbled upon it. The device was carefully transported to their homeland, and researched in secret. What they eventually uncovered was the fact that the device was not made by man. Aliens! Perhaps it came from a distant planet, or some alternate world. It was not made by men. It was made by women. The intelligence that created it far surpassed that of humans. Despite not understanding how it worked, we figured out what it was used for. This device is capable of transporting things through space time. That's why it's named Transporter. Okay. But its construction is much different from what one would normally expect. If you look toward the back left corner, you'll see something resembling a tree root. This is the nucleus of the Transporter and controls its function. Okay. Yeah, there's 
Seek a way out of this room now, like I just did the other room. Oh, great. <clears throat> a monitor, right? It's not showing anything. I don't think the machine itself is on. Holy crap, there's a lot of shit in this fucking room. Yeah, oh my goodness gracious. There's a lot of stuff. How am I going to find my way through this room? Holy shit, there's a lot of stuff to look at. Alright, well, let's start by the card I saw on the table. Oh, I did not. There's a lot of stuff here. No shit, I don't see anything useful. I kind of feel like organizing it right now, because you're a woman. What is this, a card? Human and Two Moons card. What's this? I have no idea. I've never seen it before. Nothing happens when you touch it. The surface is cold. So I'm probably going to have to pick up all the cards. It's a bird. Birdman. Birdman! A pentagram. Star card. What the fuck? I bet all the cards go in this in a certain order. Do you know what, Sigma? It looks fragile. I don't think it goes vertical and horizontal axes. You're right. It means we probably can't use it now. Alright, so let's go ahead and just pick up all these cards, because I know that's what I gotta do. Two moons. A uh, human and moon. Blocker won't open. 
I doubt we have to be concerned. It's probably just a change of clothes. Yeah, I'm sure, because, you know, in this game, things just, you know, randomly mean nothing. What is this card? A flower card. Fucking cards everywhere. Three moons. A wind card. A one moon card, right? Yep. There's a star and a moon. Okay. Crescent moon and star. My time sky. Same here. Blah, blah, blah. What's this? Alright, what are this? Two humans. It's weird looking humans. One human. A sun card. How do you know that's a sun? How are they guessing that these are the symbols that are correct? Alright, so let's see. Let's go back to this, because I think I put the cards in here. I bet we can fit something into the vertical and horizontal axes. Let's see if we can find something that fits. So no, I don't have anything I can fit in there yet. The cards don't. I thought the cards would. Alright, so let's check out this. Nucleus Zero described. It looks creepy. So the Nucleus of Transport controls the function. We need to restart it. How are we going to do that? I don't know. I see two control panels. What's this? What is a stand? It's some sort of device, but I'm not sure what kind. Place cards here. So we'll do that in a second. Let's see what this is first. Nope. I thought I could press that button or something. I see a power cord on the bottom. It won't let me mess with the power cord. Okay, place cards here. Let's try with this card. Go ahead. The light bottle turned on. Hunt the color of the card change. I thought it was already like that. No, stupid, it went to green. That's something darker, I think. Regardless, we still don't know everything. Let's find more cards. Alright. So you gonna make me do each one separately. It is, it's gonna make me do each one separately. Alright, let's put all the cards in. It's going in a pattern, too. I wonder if I'm supposed to put these in a specific pattern or just put the cards in. I'll try and do this as quick as I can. It's very tedious. <laughs> Why would it make you do each one individually? Just make sure you have them all? I got them all. I can see the number of buttons on the machine and the number of cards I have. I know I'm right. Okay. Just put them all in at once, stupid! Last one. Huh? What's that? A book. Let's check it out. A hologram book. Holographic book. The hologram stereo copy. Wow, incredible. There's a picture in the air. Is it okay to touch? It should be fine, but why? There's only a picture after all. You can't feel it. Isn't poking your hand through the hologram fun? Hee <laughs> hee, come try it out. Okay, chapter one. Okay, the wind equals zero. Okay, so all these cards have numerical values. Bird, bird, flower man. Okay. 
Okay. Whoa. Okay, something came out. I think the cards can be fit here. Okay. Bird. Bird. There's no bird flower or flower bird or flower man. I'm trying to make it match, because the next one would be flower. Oh, here we go, and then man. Stupid, there you go. Oh, yeah, that failed. What should we put here? I'm pretty sure we used the cards, I still don't really understand this. Let's try it the other way. Let's put the man. Flower. Yeah, I don't have enough birds is what it is. I don't have enough cards. I need a way to make three birds with only two cards. Or put a flower man or a man flower. Because you see, one, two, there's, there's five pictures. So two of these have to be on one picture. And there's no bird flower. There's no man flower. Now there's a man bird, right? No, there's a man moon. A man, two moons. Huh. Something, something's not driving here. So something has to mean something else. So there's, there's got to be something that means something else. Let's go check this out. Cause this is weird. Hey, come on. You guys are supposed to help me. What are you doing here? Help me. <laughs> His back is just about the size of one of those cards we found. Let's try putting one here. Okay. I got it. I know what to do. I need a bird. Okay, next card's gonna be a man. Watch, that makes a man. A single man. No? Okay. Flower, maybe? same symbol. Maybe the same symbol with different colors. Can I change the colors back again? Nothing happened. We used that card earlier. It seems it can be triggered only once. Hmm. Nope, can't touch the bottom of it. Can you put the cards on more than once? Yes, yes you can. So I can't use any of those yet. I gotta get the power back on first. Symbols are the same ones on the cards, they're all lined up. It's connected to something, let's see if we can find some clues first. Okay, let's see. Flower against flower definitely doesn't work. Okay. So let's see. Is there something that's the opposite of flower? Can I combine bird and man, maybe? Nope, won't let me combine. Down. 
Interesting. This is among the upsides still. We lost, but why? I'm just randomly putting stuff on that to see if anything happens. It's among the upsides still here. We lost, but why? Okay, so. It's gotta go back to. Let's check this out. Yes, bird three times slower than man. It's something to do with the cards. Alright, I'm missing something. Oh, there's no information in here. Maybe there's something else we can check. Oh, here we go. The alien civilization that created this transport utilized 13 symbols, each one representing a number of 0 to 12. The relationships are as follows. Ew, it's math. Ugh. Ugh. Ah, oh, do I gotta do math right now? I don't wanna do math. Aren't one of you guys math people? Can't one of you guys do something? This looks like freaking algebra. Uh huh. Alright, well, let me get a piece of paper. I'll do some algebra. I'm trying to play a game, I gotta do fucking schoolwork. I get enough school not being at home. Alright, so let's see. Do I really want to write all this down? Man and moon equals man and moon times moon. Two mans equals man times man. Oh, I'm already figuring something out in my head as I'm writing it down. Oh, I don't need to write none of this down. It's it's obvious. So each double represents two singles. Okay. Question. Well, this is this. I know that for sure. So what times what is double itself? Two times two is four. So it means man is two, doubles four. And what times what times what equals two times four times four times eight? Alright, we're gonna have to get back to that. I have an idea. I have an idea, it's just kind of going through my head right now, so I'm going to go try it out before I forget it. Okay. Okay. Hmm. So something something, flower man, three birds. close, so come on. Let's try it again. Alright, you want, this, this is the symbol for zero though, but I'll put that in. Okay. Bird, flower, man. Nope, not it, Misty. So this is what everything means right here. There's no bird in there. There's no bird. You guys see that? There's no bird symbols. There's also no wind symbols. There's no flower symbol.
And you see, you can't figure it out because there's no, there's no constants. 1 times 1 equals 1. 1 times 1 times 1 equals 1. But this would have to be a, a single moon also. So you can't, you can't just randomly guess a number. 2 times 2 times 2, that's 2 times that would be 4. 2 times 2 is 4, times 4 is 8. So that would be the symbol of 8. So that would be 2, 2, and 8. And that's just guessing. There's no way to really know. And then that'd be 2 times 2, and then 2 moons would be 4. Okay? And so that means what times 2 times 2 equals something else? Okay, so maybe 1 times 2 is 2 times 2. So that would be 2, and then 2 would be a 1 moon, not a man and 2 moons. So the man could be a, a 3. 3 times 2 is 6. Times 2 is 12. And then a man and 2 moons would be 12. Right? But what would, there'd have to be a number 1 somewhere. So if the man is 3, that'd be 3 times 3, and then 2 moons would be 6, or 2 men would be 6. That means a man would be 3, then a moon would be 2. Well, 2 men would be 9. And a man and a moon would be six. So we're still missing a one, a five, a seven, and an eight. So a, a star and a moon would be ten. Okay, let's try that. I, I'm just, I just randomly guessed a couple numbers and just threw them in there to see if I can make them work. Okay? So, 2 would be a moon. Right? 4 would be 2 moons. Okay. 3 would be 1 man. Okay. A man and 2 moons would be 12. 2 moons, I already got that. Okay. Ten would be a star and a moon. Okay. Do we know anything else? Six, three, two, six would be a man and a moon. And that's all I could from the from the chart that they gave me, that's all I could figure out right now. No, the star would be 5. Right, so that's true, too. So I still have 5 variables. Okay, um, 2 man, if a man is 3, then 2 men would be 9, so that's not a variable anymore. I got 4 variables. Okay, 3 moons would have to be 8. Okay, I don't know about the bird, but let's take that off. So I got 3 variables right now. A 1, a 7, and 11. Well, I, I would assume... No, you can't assume that. Okay. And the only reason I can't figure these three out is because the other chart didn't have those these three symbols. So how can you figure it out if there's no symbols? So let's do a variable check. Well, bird, sunflower. Okay, so that's obviously not right. Well, you leave the bird as our constants at the moment. I'm doing this logic-based right now. So the bird is our constant right now. No. Okay, so the bird's obviously wrong. So we'll make the sun our constant. Got it! Oh shit! Look at that fucking logic at work! Holy fuck! Oh my god, I'm a fucking genius. That is great, man. I totally logic the shit out of that puzzle. Okay, number three. Oh, ho, ho, who's your fucking daddy? All right, let's write this down so I got this all figured out.
That's fucking cool. Yeah, yeah, I got the number of columns right now. Okay, let's see what number four, chapter four. In order to operate the nucleus, four cards must be placed on the sensor. The alien society has two methods for expressing numbers, however. Oh, great. So we, we got one, but we can't get the other. By converting the number symbols displayed in the nucleus to the format, you'll determine the correct cards to place. All right, so. Oh, that's great. I feel good. I feel really good about fucking getting that figured out. Something on here that was not on here before. Okay, that's the symbol, so I can look back here as a reference anytime I need to. Nothing else? Alright, so we got, we got three birds, a sun, and a man, and we need to use them to four cards. We know that birds are 11. What the fuck? Okay. Uh, seven is a, is a flower, and the man is six. So that's 13. So, let's wind. Let's see, wind. Wind. No. That made 13. I figured it would be 13. Hmm. Yeah, we're missing something. We're still missing something. All right. Let's see. The birds are 11, so that's, that's, that's 33, that's 38, that's 41. So if you add the numbers up on top together, it's 41. So you only get 41 in the four slots. That's one. Ten. No. Nope. That's eleven, so we need twenty. No, we need thirty. And I only have room for twenty-four. Okay, hold on. Let's try and get forty-one out of this, right? A man and two moons, that's twelve. Twenty three. Thirty three. This will be forty one. No, I got forty one just like what it says on top, so we gotta figure something else out. We still We gather the symbols up there, eleven, eleven, seven, three. Is that answer four digits? If not, we have to change it to fit. What the fuck? Some of the cards in the game would be wins. So maybe you're supposed to put the cards down and keep the pattern laid out above. No, I gotta fucking get a calculator because they want me to multiply all that together. They want me to do 11 times 11 times 11. times seven times three. And that's not, that's five digits. That's 27,951. Hmm. I don't know. Let's see, 11 times 11 times seven times three. That's 27,951. So 27951 is five numbers, not four. Woof, this is tough.
So we have to change it to fit. How do you change five numbers and four numbers to fit? Oh, you can do two. You can't do 79. You can't do 95. You can't do 51. You can't, there's no 20 number for 27 either. Maybe 12, 7, 9, 5. If we go, see, if we go 12, that would be the last number from 27, 9, 51, and the first number of 27, 9, 51, which would be 12. That would be a man and two moon. Let's try that. And then 7, 9, and 5. That would be 7, 9, and 5. This is the only thing I could work out so far. No. Hmm. Let's try seven nine five twelve. Seven nine five and twelve. Nope. All right, let's go back to this thing. They showed a flower which was seven. So they keep using the bird, which is 11. So beat the bird, we need to put in a 12. And that's this one here. Okay, let's put the 12 in again. Nothing beats the 12, right? see a bird, right? I wasn't even watching that one. Shit. Something, a bird, something. Let's start over again. Okay, sun. See, they're doing any kind of pattern. Sun, a bird. A bird. So we should, we should have flower next. pattern. <sighs> Unless this next one's a bird, then there is a pattern. Let's put in the wind. It's a zero. The last one I lose, so it's like I'm supposed to win. 
Well, the next one should be the sun, anyway, if I'm reading the patterns correctly. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> okay, there's got to be something I'm missing here. Come on, show me something. Show me love. Come on, stop it. I'm trying to move around the room. You know what I'm trying to do. Something's on the monitor. Explain a 3D object. It's 3D printer after all. Does that mean it's going to make it now? I think so. Let's try it. Oh, I had to click on the monitor! Ah! I was overthinking it. Overthinking. Okay, De Decagon Reels. Okay, so now we have Decagon Reels. Five Decagon Rings. Each side is marked like these cards. Okay. So now let's go put these in that machine that we got over here. Let's try putting the wheels we found in the machine. There's five wheels, so it should fit. And remember, 11 times 11 times 7 times 3 was 27,951. So let's put in. Oh, won't we change it? The deck and wheels are in place in the hexagon axis, and they're on the vertical engine. So it won't let me do anything with it yet. I gotta find something else. I gotta make something to go in here. Alright. Fuck you, you stupid bird. Something else appeared. Same as before, it looks a little different. Let's try to make it. Yeah, I figured that. I got you all figured out, game! You ain't got nothing on me! I got this shit in the fucking bag! Yeah! Alright, so now we got another tri gun reel. And now the picture's blank. Alright. We're fucking outsmarting the fuck out of this game! Okay, put the wheels in there. Cool, we have wheels that should fit. Alright, that was easy enough. Now we have both sets of reels in, see if we can do anything with it. Alright, so this will be a bird. What? Okay, let's go uh, put in a two first, which is just a moon, right? Okay, and then... A flower? Okay, and then two men. And then a star. And then sun. Alright. It's a conversion machine! It took 27951 and put it into four numbers, and those are the symbols I got to put over there. Yes! We got it figured out. We got it all figured out. Oh, it's a conversion machine. It's a Rosetta fucking stone. Ha! 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 I got this shit fucking figured. All right, let's go back. Yeah, yeah, you guys can tell me what I already figured out. I already figured it out, fuckers. You don't need to tell me. I got this shit. I got this right here. Alright. Watch! Here it is! Boom! boom! Woohoo! Yeah! I fucking got it! Oh, I think I did it. Yeah, it looks like you're successful. Now what will happen? Yeah, baby! Yeah! That's what I'm talking about! Got that shit figured!
My mind is a beautiful it thing. <laughs> yes, but. But how did we add all those numbers together without a calculator? CD, Carlos, Junpei, QT, Q, Mira. Oh shit, they're all dead? DT, Baha. These six are now deceased. They said Bai's dead? What? what? It can't be. So maybe while they were here fucking around, she's being incinerated, Has burning up. And subsequently, closed. Oh, <gasps> that was the exit. The exit opened and closed. So Connie probably killed the other ones the and got out. Has now been concluded. Thank you for participating. Holy shit! This isn't what we wanted to happen. We didn't want this at all. You tricked us, Zero. Zero is a dick. I think all this these games are rigged. It, it's, it's gotta, gotta be. be. I, I refuse, refuse to believe, to believe this, this is, is true. true. Sigma. <laughs> Sigma going crazy. Hey, hey fine. fine. Where the Where hell, hell are, are you? you? Check the incinerator. Check the incinerator. Go. Are you go somewhere? somewhere. Go look in the incinerator. <laughs> you can't speak. Shut up. Just make, Just make a noise! noise. Bitch got burnt! Please. Bitch got cooked! Well done! Please! Answer, Answer me, me, damn it! it! Yep, they're in the incinerator! Look in the incinerator! Look in the window! Look in the window! <laughs> Yep, she's in there! She's in there! Ha <laughs> She saw her! Mmm, five well done. Diana! Diana. What the hell? Hey! hey what's, what's wrong? wrong? Are you alright? Right. What happened to the rest of the transporter room? You okay? okay? Yes. yes. Thank, Thank you. you. And Fry? Fry is crispy. So how could it be a this crispy sort of message if they know who we'll dies when they die? Again, then. Well, because we gotta stay down here yeah. and repopulate. Did a Connie leave alone? Because she killed people and wanted to get out of there, I no bet. Idea. There's, there's, there's no, no way, way to tell what happened, happened over in Ward C. <laughs> Ward C's had an orgy. We only know one, one thing. thing. Carlos, Carlos and June Pear are dead. That's it. You don't know that for sure. You know that's what so Zero told you. You believe the announcement? Exactly. You don't know for sure. Well, if, if what, what it said, it said earlier, earlier is true, true then, then that means Q-Team is dead as well. But unlike, unlike C-Team, we, we can figure, figure out exactly how Q-Team died. died. They were, they were executed. executed. Likely. Huh. Because, because of the of vote at 1330. 1330. Oh yeah, that's right. Diana, Diana. I, believe I believe you picked, picked Q-Team Q -team, then, then, right? right. Yes. yes, but, but I, I... I know. You, remember you just did, did as, as the note, note suggested. suggested. The, the real, real betrayer is... Carlos. Carlos. Not good. It's almost it's time for us to get injected, injected again. again. Huh, minute 25, you guys are gonna... We don't have time to waste. waste. Come with, Come with me. me. What's he got planned? Six. 
Sigma, what are you, what are you doing? doing? Yeah, really, what are you doing? The X store, the X -Store will never open, open again. again. Now, all, all we can we do, do here, here is just, just wait, wait to die. To die. Wait, you don't, you don't mean you're planning, planning to transport? transport? What, other what other choice do we have? We have one, to wait, wait for Akane. Akane. I'm sure, sure the police, the police or, or a rescue, rescue team will... We can't count on that. But why? This is the Treeform timeline, then. Listen to me, Sigma! This is not the time for pointless arguing. We are escaping this horrible history. We're going to where Phi exists. It said you can't go together, so only one of you can get? I've selected the transfer point. All we have to do is pull this lever. Then, we need to run to the input pods. Wait! I'm going to go even if you aren't. Oh, shit! I'm starting it. You ready? Okay, so he's going in no matter what. You got to decide. Is she going in or is she not going in? You better decide quick. Okay, so he's going in, definitely. So do we want to go in or not go in? But remember, it said two people can't go in. But if we don't go in, it don't start up again for another ten months. So we'll have to wait for Akani to come rescue us if she comes to rescue us. So do you take the chance and hope the machine can reconstruct you correctly, even though it says it, it, it won't? Or do you wait down here to starve to death and hopefully someone will come rescue you? Okay, you guys want me to transport? Transport it is. I'm, like I said, I'm going to listen to what you guys want. So let's see, we'll transport. See what happens. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Let's do this. Let's hurry. Let's hurry. They're gonna come out like morphed together like a version of the fly. Wins well, wins well. It's fun as hell, it's excellent. Let's see, we'd live or not to live? That is the question. Or would he come out like a mutated mess of goo? Ah, don't tell us! No! No! Tell us! Why didn't you tell us? No, we want to know! Okay, we only got one choice. It took away all of our other choices. Check our floor chart. Okay, this is the one we did down here. Okay, this is how we go to see it. Let's see what it just says. Do we make it or do we not make it? We're still okay! Woo! It worked! You guys made the right choice! What in the world is going on? You're in another reality now! You're in another, another we existence! We went into the input pots, and now we came right back out of the same ones. You're in a different existence but now, not stupid. The export pots. Oh yeah, they're supposed to come out the export pots, that's right. Did, did the, the process fail? No, no wait. wait. Hold on, Hold a, on sec. a sec. Let me Let think, think about, about this, this for a for minute. A minute. Okay? okay? They both have tails. Plot yeah. twist. Yeah. yeah. I get, I it, get now. it now. 
you understand what happened? Yeah, Remember what Zero says. says. This, this transporter isn't, isn't one, one that simply teleports, teleports various, various objects. objects. What is transferred is only the terminal data. The object itself does not go transported. I see. I remember, I remember one time with my, my grandma, grandma years ago. ago. The, 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 the first time, time she sent me a fax, she, she said, stays there. The paper came back, Sigma. Maybe it didn't go through successfully. It's the same thing. Just like how the fax doesn't send the actual paper, we too. Our original bodies remain. And only the red data went to the transfer point? But there's one thing I don't get. Why is this me? The one that stays. If our data did end up transferring correctly, it wouldn't have been a surprise to see we were in the transfer point world. So why are we still here? Oh, because you got fucked. That's why. Zero done fucked you. Sorry. I know how strange this sounds. It's clearly an esoteric conundrum. Even after, after thinking, thinking extensively, extensively on it, on it I'm, not sure I'm not sure I figure it no out. no idea what those fucking words mean, you idiot. But I do I know, know one thing for sure. sure. We need to have sex right now. We've, We've run, run out, out of cards, cards in our deck. deck. So they've transferred their, their copies of themselves to another existence. So that means another existence they're going to appear. Very interesting. And then we still only have the one choice over here. All right, let's check out our last choice. All right, and this will be the last fragment I do tonight, and then I'm going to go get some rest. So we'll do this last fragment together, and then uh, we'll come back tomorrow and do more. The Door of Truth. Oh, this is their consciousness going through the place. This is their faxed forms. No, Maple, stay for this. Maple, you gotta stay for this. You don't wanna Did miss this. Really work? Well. We got, we got into, into the input, input pods, pods, and we and came, came out, out of... of... The export the pods. pods? So it's them, Diana, but it's not your watch. 1805. Well, we climbed into the pods around 1.30 in the morning, the morning on New Year's. New Year's. So, so, we went, we went back, back in time? time? We could go back in but, time. But, huh. It could be possible that it's 1805 on January 1st, though. Good point. But it also means it could be two or three days off. Or even three or four years. There's no way to know the exact date or time. Even what we see on this watch could be fake. We have no idea. Yeah, you're just fucking microwaved. I wouldn't worry about anything right now. Sigma, can I ask you something? Can I have your babies? You were, you were the one, the one who, prepared who prepared everything on the input, input console, console, right? Yes. yes. Where, where exactly, exactly did you set it to? to? Good question. What do you mean, where? where? The, the transfer, transfer point for the transporter. Transport. Uh, I don't, I don't know. know. I was just hitting buttons randomly. What? what? It's, not it's not my fault. fault. We, didn't we didn't have time. time. Sure you did. Uh, I, 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 I couldn't I read any of the any text on the display, so... I pushed a random button. A random? random? Wow, he's an idiot. It, it, it doesn't, it doesn't matter. matter. It's still, it's still highly, highly likely, likely we came out in an alternate, alternate history. history. <laughs> and and if that's true. true. If it wasn't true, they'd come out of the pods right here. now. They'd see themselves coming out of the pods. So it has to be a different reality. Bye! Bye! Oh, and this is where they find her in the incinerator, right? It doesn't, it doesn't look, look like, like she's here. She's here.
Is this a reality that's before this, the this, incinerated this. reality? It has to be. Oh, and that's, yeah, I remember that one. Their heads exploded. So they got a chance to save five. 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 Tell me you're Tell safe. Me you're safe. The Where are you? Now. You guys know where you're at, where she's at. You saw her fucking burn a body incinerator, Incinerate. stupid. So go straight to the incinerator, not running around every other fucking room. Maybe the history we're in. What was that? You guys are fucking idiots. Now you're locked in another room. It won't open. You knew very anyway, well you saw her dead in the other let's one. Let's find a way out of here. We'll talk, we'll talk later. later. Ah, uh, okay. Let's do this one, and then I'll go to bed. All right, so let's see. Spin. Somebody pissed all over the floor when the drain was clogged. See something inside there, I see a hose in there. Okay, they want me to turn the lights on. What the fuck is this? It's a device with a cover screwed on here. We have to open it to examine it. It must be here for some reason. So you guys don't got in the fucking transporter, made it into an alternate reality just to get fucking trapped in another room like jackasses because you didn't go straight to the incinerator where you knew she was. Nine buttons on it. It's a lock. Oh, it's got some kind of color code. <laughs> I'm not gonna randomly guess that. All right, let's see. So there's a color code, a nine digit lock. <laughs> A hair dryer. Okay, the hair dryer plugs into a different outlet. Spin. Something, something. So we got to spin that to be able to read what it says. So we gotta turn the power on. No water's coming out. No water's coming out. There's something in the drain, but they can't reach it. That light's on, we gotta get this light on. Alright, so the first clue is to be able to get the lights on. Because they won't let me see anything in the darkness. Okay, I got a hair dryer. Maybe I can like put my face in the water and throw the hair dryer in the water. Water doesn't look quite right. I wouldn't even go so far as to think it could be dangerous. Don't step inside. It's locked. Maybe we can find a way out of here. Okay. So now we got most of the clues down already. Let's check the lock that we can't open. If only there was a cat in here. Now that would be perfectly calm my nerves. Wow. Uh, if you can tell. I have a litter tick whenever I talk about cats. I, all right, I guess it's okay. all right, There's something in the locker. What is it? It's a conversion plug, so that's for the for the uh, hair dryer. Okay, a letter. What does it say? The power supply must be restarted to unlock the door. No shit. Great. Thanks for that fucking awesome words of wisdom. A music box, the large disc. Why is there a music box inside the locker? It says, run on water up here. 
a music box that runs on water. So it's that hose that's inside the, the bathroom stall will hook up to this. Alright, so let's go ahead and plug the hair dryer in. Okay, conversion plug in the outlet. What? I think conversion plug will fit in the out outlet, but why plug it in by itself? So let's combine these two, obviously. Alright. And now we'll plug it in. Okay, it fits. So what we do now is give ourselves fantastic blowouts with it. Maybe spin the fan up there. Oh yes, where the spin is on the wall. Let's try it out. Violet, white, blue, red. Okay. Violet, white, blue, red. This room's easy so far. I had much harder rooms than this one already. Violet, white, blue, red. Got that done. Yeah, this room's no problem so far. What's inside? Coin. I don't think it'd be very helpful in here. A second coin with double or triple sevens on it. They want to do a coin toss. Stupid. I don't need coins to make my decisions. Oh, there's a remote controller in there. Okay, what does the remote controller do? There's only one button on it. Push the button, yes. Nothing's responding. Okay, let's use the coin to open up the door. Hopefully that'll work. Yep, we'll do this coin. See, I got this shit fucking figured out. Okay, yes, it's open. Let's check out what's inside. Flip the switch to on. Switch is stuck and we can't move it. How do we connect the cable to the one that connect the cable? A hole in the shape of a C. Okay, nothing responded. It is a hole in the shape of a C. Cables. How about we connect those cables on the left first? Okay, so I plugged it back in. I think the power's on. Let's check it out. Okay, so you can't turn on both lights at once. It's one or the other. Now I'll be able to see the stalls, but I can't see those locks anymore. I got this shit. Come on, this is nothing. The water on the floor is keeping us from searching the side of the room. It's better we don't step in if the water looks questionable. Is there any way we can drain it? Yeah, this. Aha! Aha! I'm kicking the shit out of this room. Uh, Start button. It's probably got a C on the back of it, right? Get that. Okay. Want to get the hose out of here is what I'm trying to do now. Door is it open? Maybe it's locked. It's a key. No, I gotta use this on that on that box over there, and that'll open that up. Let's check out everything else first. A water tank. Why is it here? Because there's something in it. Clearly out of place, it's supposed to be a good reason to examine it. Oh, there's a cover here, but it's screwed shut. Can we use the coin? The screw's too small, if only we had a screwdriver. So there's the C key right here. Water taken in the shower room, plants in the water, so planning on getting some fish. All places he puts it in here. Small part inside. Could be a decoration, but I'm intrigued. We can't take the cover off, so we can't reach it. Okay. Check out the other one. Oh, 
Alright, what's in here? A normal shower room. The bucket is that for cleaning. Maybe we can find another use aside from wearing it. So now I have a bucket. There's now, but nothing came out. Nothing came out. Shower head, nothing came out. How about we fucking throw the bucket at the glass and break the glass? Okay, uh, there's something on the wall. The notes. Fully submerge the power supply in water to start it. Okay. No water. Alright. So, so far, I'm doing pretty good. Let's go back to here. Switch. Go back. Okay, hold on a second. I got to fully submerge the power cell in the water, right? So we gotta go back here. We're not done with this yet. Okay, back. We're gonna use the remote control again. Right, and then I'll fill it up with water. I gotta find a place to use that button. There we go. Why does it stop? It should keep pouring out. Okay, I got it. 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 Okay, we pull the bucket up with water. Right. Alright, now we go here and turn the light switch back on. Pouring water on it is enough to restart it. Oh, I'm, I'm not trying to use the bucket. I had the bucket in my hand, that's how I was doing that. Right, here we go. Use the bucket of water. On here. No? There we go. Now all that's going to make this pop up over here. Aha! I got a key. Woo! This is too easy now. They're making this too easy for me. The puzzles are so hard that when it comes time to figure out an easier one, I can just breeze through it, it looks like. I'm not freezing through it, but it's not that bad. Haha! -ha! Now we got a hose. Hey, I wasn't done there. Okay, there are no gaps between the floor and frame. It's really closed up. Okay, so let's get out of here. Yeah, what should we show? Okay. So once I start the water, the water's going to flood the room. It's going to go up all the way high and start that machine on, right? Okay, so let's use the hose on this right here. Huh? Hose doesn't fit on the faucet. What about what's above? We'll have to take the shower head off. Okay. 
It's crooked because the screws are loose. Can't I just knock it off? Well, let's try this one. No, it's got to be this one. Then. Let's go see if I can hook the water hose up first. That might be what they want me to do. Water hose. Close my reach. Connect it to that. We have to get some water running and the music box will play. We have to connect the hose here and put the other end in the shower room. The hose should reach the shower on the far right. Alright, so I knew what to do. They reiterated it for me. It's too dark. Okay, so I gotta figure out how to turn this on. Maybe I get to the switch again? Okay, so what else is in here that I'm missing? Alright, I'm missing something. What am I missing here? I'm glad it got me stuck somewhere because I was getting through this room way too quickly. I don't see anything else. I gotta get knocked that off somehow. I don't want it to click on. Okay, they're just being stupid. <laughs> they're only talking about the part. It won't let me focus on nothing else but the part. Cover screwed shut. Nothing else in here? Okay, nothing else in there. This leads me to believe that the shower is the only thing left for me to look at, but I have. Alright, so I got the music box, I got a nine digit code, a start button. Okay, now I'm gonna get a little, a little stuck. But... Alright, now the room's back on. Okay, so there's a nine digit pattern, right? Nine buttons. I'm sure, sure we might find something that'll help us. So let's see. Nine buttons. We searched thoroughly. We might find something that'll help us. Ok, 
Okay. Hmm. I think the music box, once I get that powered, is going to give me the combination to the lock. Yeah, I did the spin. The spin got me the uh, the middle locker open. So something's something's broken right now. Oh, look at this. Look on that. Look on the, the drain. You had to shut the light off for the numbers to glow. Because when the light's on, you couldn't see the numbers. That's funny. That's that's pretty cool. Because <laughs> when the light's on, it's just a, a regular drain. But the numbers glow in the dark. Uh, five, four, one, two, nine, seven, six, three, eight. That that's pretty ingenious. I I do like that. That's pretty cool. I got like a wrench or something in here. Displaying something on this monitor. What the fuck is this? Dragon Ball Z and shit. Oh wow. Okay, you gotta make them all match. It's a puzzle game. I don't know who you're fucking with here. I got fucking puzzles down. You don't know. You guys don't even know who you're fucking with. I got fucking puzzles out the ass. I can do this shit. I'm, I'm close though. I'm real close. Where's it messed up? It don't look messed up to me. Where's it messed up at? Oh, I got, I got to put all the clouds together too, maybe. Yeah. Ha! Ha! Fuck your little puzzle. I'll beat the shit out of stuff like that. You gotta come at me a lot stronger than that, son. The door opened and something's inside. Got a screwdriver. You gotta come at me a lot stronger than that, son. That's nothing for me. Uh, let's change the lights. What do you guys think you're messing with? That's nothing. Let's open this up. The button in there, because I know I got the button. Tear the shit out of this room. Push the button. Okay. Got a piece. Got it. Nope. Back over here. Put the piece in. Screwdriver again. There we go. Hose. Okay, I put the hose into there, and I gotta close the drain on the floor. She knows the melody. Ok, 
Okay, the note. Fill the room with... I already know fill the room with water. You guys tell me shit I already figured out. You're giving me easy puzzles. But shit I already figured out. Now I gotta close the drain. Okay, get inside the shower first. Now we we'll use the... Watch this shit. Look how easy! I figured this shit like it's nothing! Booyah! Lids closed, everything goes for the plan. The room will fill with water. And the room does fill with water. Oh shit! I thought it was gonna break on me. I was like, no! Water drained away. Oh wow, that was scary. You think it's okay to go out? Everything in red. Emergency power's on. I'm glad it's not completely dark. Push the button again. So just in case the water tries to fill up again, it'll drain. Oh, I closed it. I don't think it matters. Whoa, look at that. That'll restart the system if I click it. Is there anything else in here in the dark for me to see? No. No. Alright, let's restart the system. It wasn't doing that before. Maybe it's because the room was full of water. The door should open if we push this. On that note, let's push it. Whoa! Whoa! That's not the door opening! That's a hidden door! What the fuck? That's the Peepin' Tom door. That's when you come in to see people in the shower. Dude, I kicked the shit out of that room! Hell yeah! Fuck that, that room was my bitch! Why is there a door here? So you can peep on people in the shower. I was right. The store, the store isn't marked, marked on the map. The map. It, won't it won't open? open? The keypad. Nope. nope. It's, it's locked, locked up, up tight. tight. It looks, looks like you need to put no a code shark. in here. No shark, sure up. Anything, Anything come to mind? <sighs> All I can All tell, tell is that it's an eight-digit eight number. An eight-digit eight number? Decide. What do I gotta decide? Make your decision. Enter the code. I don't. I don't know. How do I know the code? I have no. How would I have any kind of clue at all? Anything. I wonder if there are any hints around here. Hints. Hints. Okay, that was that for that. Let's check our flow chart. That's where we just were, I believe. Yeah. So fast forward this. Oh, and I guess I'll get the code when I come back here. No. Alright, so we gotta know an eight digit code that we gotta get from somewhere else. No, the fan gave uh, um, four different um, colors. This is something different. Wonder, Wonder if there's, there's anything, anything else around, around here. here. Oh, they gave us more again. They brought them all back so we can actually do the other ones again. We got two new ones. Hmm. Well, should I do another one, or should I go to bed? What do you guys think? I 
I'm having a lot of fun with this game. But yeah, yeah, it is. It's after midnight, so I'm going to go to bed. That was enough. We did uh, two and a half hours. I will come back tomorrow, and I will play some more, because I really want to see where this is going. Okay, so if you guys want to come back tomorrow, come back tomorrow, and we will play some more. Because I want to I wanna keep going with this game. Two and a half hours is enough for now. Okay, thank you guys very much for watching. We're going to continue with D-Team tomorrow. Make sure you come back. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe. If you want to follow, follow. And if you guys want to see anything else that I've already replayed in the past, go to Domination Gaming Channel on YouTube, and you can see it there. Thank you very much, and I'm not a cutie pie. Shut up. <laughs> and I will see you later. Good night. Hugs, hugs.